If I had it my way, I would definitely be indoors first, but most, most people don't want to do that. They want to see yeah. their ball fly. Yeah. But I convinced my, my kids, we're going to do 10 minutes of crap. And they go, what do you mean 10 minutes of crap? You're allowed to hit the ball like crap, and, and that's okay. And yeah, no judgment on you. Yeah. No judgment on you, and that's how you get better. I'll do 10 minutes of this. Now, let's go five minutes of, let's go through routine and see what it does, yeah. and then go back to 10 minutes of, it's okay to, to hit it like crap. Yeah. Just to get our motion right. And then at the end of the lesson, it's basically, let's let you fly. Yeah. Makes sense? Mm -hmm. But yeah, I think that that's probably, that's why, you know, a lot of the countries that have a lot of weather issues don't have problems with their motion. Yeah. I think a lot of them have great motion there. Oh yeah. One of the things that I've seen in this journey to be better for, for me over the last, uh, I've been doing it now 10 months or something, uh, is just, I, I, th I think the first thing people, if you really want to get better at golf, I think the first thing people have to do is, is be okay with being embarrassed. Most of my kids that are clowns, that's why I, I mean, I, I'm kind of a clown, as if you probably didn't know, but most of my kids are clowns, so I attract other guys that yeah. have personalities that are a little bit off, okay? Mm. So by that being is these kids aren't embarrassed to look dumb. They're not embarrassed to shoot 100. And when you're not embarrassed to put a, shoot 100, now your ego's not on and you're not putting pressure on yourself. And yeah. if I, if, when kids are worried about, hey, if I play bad or if I hit a bad shot or I do any of this, I'm gonna be embarrassed, I'm gonna look bad, so now I can't do it. I'm just yeah. gonna hide, mm -hmm. okay? You're never gonna improve. Be willing to look stupid in golf and I promise you'll be a better golfer. Be willing to actually laugh at yourself and go, so I hit it bad. I have kids when I'm working on a motion, they're always going, hey, yeah. you just shank that or you just snap hook that. I go, so? I'm yeah. going to go shoot 6'6". Six, six. Who cares? Right. That's the way, I, I mean, that's what I'll tell them. And, yeah. and that's the way it is. You know what I mean? It, I'm going to hit a couple shots I'd now, love to George. see it. So that's it. I'm actually, without any warm up here, I'm going to hit my driver only because wow. I basically vlog every single hole of golf I play. So there's no secrets. Everybody sees my golf game. So okay, not, so your 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 ego's not on, and you you have no embarrassment. I like. Oh that. no, my my ego is is a very big factor, but whatever. <laughs> but you, well, that's this how you get over it. So, Good. Good for no, you. The reason the reason I want to hit my driver now, the driver more than any other club is the club that I want to lunge at. Okay. Got some speed. I like that. It's good. Well, I would say that your your right leg didn't go too internal oh, no, there at all. Good. It's I mean, actually yeah. really good. I don't yeah. I don't see any internal motion there. Mm -hmm. I would say with the driver, I would say that you probably hit about one one degree down on that or two degrees down. That's true. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm just looking at your motion here um, without without the now your left leg's working awesome there. I'd say if anything, for my players that are hitting more up on it, they're a little bit more back or. They're, they're either turning and then kicking up, but they're not sliding to get back. That's yeah. a huge difference mm -hmm. to me. But I would say if I were you and I was working on it, I think that that's great leg work to hear. And then from here, I'd start kicking up and back to get more on the up. That, that's see, optional. In, in your players, you see a lot of, a lot of uh, from this point to the finish, a lot of upward motion. Upward. A lot of like, kind of like if you're snapping a towel or something. Yeah. And me, I, at, at closer to impact, I don't have very much more room to go up. Well, so would you recommend me staying a little bit more uh, more bent? Well, here's the deal. So what what are we doing with the driver? Why yeah. are we going up? Because we get optimal numbers, right? Yeah. Uh, there's tilt. So if we had it straight up and down yeah. and I added a little bit of tilt now, am I doing it with the hip? Some players do. Um, yeah. But I'm just giving a little bit of right lateral bend, which means the spine's curving a little bit. Um, and then for a lot of players, you'll see them with the driver, their head is moving behind that and staying behind that. Yeah. Um, and I try and give you about seven degrees of tilted address. So some players are staying here all the way, all the way down to here, and then they're kicking behind that. So if you look at like a Rory, Rory has a little tilt, he stays up here, he stays in this, and then he backs out even more out yeah. of it. Does it make sense? But I don't see a lot of guys trying to keep their head on center with their driver because that's putting not, I mean, you're not getting your optimal number. So when I look at you, yeah. I think it looks good. I just think that you could hit it a little bit so more on the up. How could I get it a little bit more on the up? Let's try, let's try okay. one. Well, let's set up. Or what would you, what would you have me do? Would you, was there a drill? Of or course there, there is. Oh. I have a shadow here. Let's say my head is right on that shadow. Mm -hmm. um, I would get a little bit of tilt here. Can they see me at all? Probably uh, yeah, not. Yeah, yeah. Okay. No, so yeah. I have a little bit of tilt here. I would maintain that tilt all the way to the top. Yeah. And then I would maintain this to here and then I'd back 
back out a little bit. Now, how am I backing out? Let's so do show, show that again. George okay. has a shadow. So okay, so it's hard to see a sun. shadow. Yeah. So let's get the right shadow. There's two shadows, but I have a little bit of a tilt. So I'm standing straight yeah. up and down. I have a little tilt from the right lateral bend. I would, with the driver, I would maintain that seven degrees of tilt. Not that you have to. There's some yeah. players that move off and stay off. Not a lot that go left. No, yeah. not a lot, but, yeah. but I don't see many that are going forward or very stacked, yep. okay? I see them with a little bit of tilt. They stay pretty centered to here or off, and then they stay pretty centered to here. And then this is after they're cleared, not bumping this way, they start to kick the pelvis, extend the legs, and that's how they get behind it. And some just have a little right lateral bend here as they go here with that action, and that gets you to even more behind it, and that gets yeah. you to hit up on the up. Now, okay. the key is if you just go like this, it's really hard to turn. Right. But if you get a round inflection like you did, mm -hmm. and then kick up, you can actually what? catch it more on the app. So I'll give you the, yep. the feel for that and we'll see if you like it. Okay. So we have the optimal amount of tilt. You look good. Okay. Mm -hmm. That looks perfect. Now go all the way top for me, please. So you already stay centered. You're staying pretty centered here. Turn, mm -hmm. turn, 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 turn. So your pressure is pretty mm -hmm. centered. I'd get yeah. you a little bit more under. Yeah. Okay. And uh -huh. then from here, you have good lateral bend. That left side's low. Yeah. I would get you a little bit more open right here. Okay. Oh, and, okay. Well, I would get you a little that more open. So and... now the right leg, let's get you on plane. And then we're going to hit you on the what? up okay? okay so remember the more up we hit where's rory in relation to the original shaft plane is he under it or over it? under under yeah. because he's hitting how far up a lot six. like four degrees yeah four to six uh, yeah. degrees up so that means in order to get zeroed out path where does his swing direction need to be at low point to the right it needs to be six degrees under to yeah. get what six up equals yeah. what one to one rate if the vsp is about what 45. Okay. okay so that means what's that doing that's pushing the path six degrees left so okay. for guys that are under how are they getting more under they're dropping back a little bit more this way but they hit up and they offset each other which equals what zero, less, yeah. zero and less what backspin okay does it make yeah. sense which is optimal for what height, yeah. spin rate, all kinds of yeah. stuff. So that's why you look at Rory, everybody loves the way he hits it. Mm -hmm. So listen. So if I was to do this without a ball, yeah. so I can it's cool. think about it. So I would go back swing and I go. No, 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 set up no. again. <laughs> that's close. I mean, you go to the top and freeze all the way top. So this is what I would do. I would say yeah. I would sit and I'd get about 50% and I'd get the shaft a little bit more down in here. Laid but off. Okay. Just a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Now from here, look at, you're not open at all. You're not, okay. I mean, oh, you're I not open. I can, can be. Exactly. There you go. Now you can fire this right shoulder, right hip as you kick up and out. There you go. That's absolutely good. Okay. Yeah. So if you look here, this is the problem is people are misunderstanding what I'm saying here and I don't know why this won't go in, but if you looked at this with this, and you go, okay, so George wants me here and back, yeah. and then where am I kicking my pelvis? Into the ball? No, I'm around here, which if you look at, see, I can see my quad here, now that can fire this way. Yeah. Now, if you looked at from this position, I'm all the way around, then I kick up. Does it make sense? But yeah, I'm not staying square. It's important that if you're doing something like this, that you give yourself something else to do to replace it. Otherwise, set up. Put this in real a, quick. A negative. 100. percent Yeah. Okay. So we put this in here, and we put this in here, but we're not going to hit a shot. Set up, please. Right. Set up. So this thing's over about 30 degrees over to the left. Okay. Yep. Now take one all the way top. Big turn. Big turn. Let this come back. There you go. That's right. a driver. Now sit and turn. First parallel. Where our hips are going to be about square. Keep the width. No, no, you don't have to. If you keep the width, that'll happen naturally. Keep the width in your right arm. It's too narrow. Good. Now, one more frame of turn. Good. Now, where are you at right here? Look at the hip. Yeah. Now you're right here. Now you can fire. Oh, now you can yeah. fire the right side. Good. There you go. Now that's optional. You don't have to do that. But yeah. what I'm saying is, if you wanted to get a little bit more up, that's yeah. what I'd recommend. That's your that's your option. What I saw before was pretty awesome. Okay. You hit it good. If you want a higher tier? You good with that? Yeah, I'm fine. All right, so uh, I don't know. I'm gonna shut my brain off and hit it and try to see if, see if I learned anything. Nice ball. Yeah, it was good. That was good. Yeah, it's nice. You're right. The, the T's a little short. But it I is too short, know. but if, yeah, that's what I'm saying. So if you got up here, mm -hmm. look at your leg work. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I love that. Beautiful, beautiful. And then back, back, back. Look at you starting to push up off the right side. So you stayed in flexion the whole time. Boom, boom, yeah. boom. Left leg went fully external. Left arm is right on your femur bone, right in line. That's beautiful. And then you back, back, back. That's, that's Tupper right there. Oh, that's beautiful. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be messing with a lot more than that. I should put that on Instagram. Show, show me, George. What? Show, hit, hit, hit a ball with my driver. Okay. No, like I said, like, yeah, I go to the golf store and I get like 3,500 spin. And so what do you do with this? And that's dead nuts. That thing's pure. Yeah. 
That's pure. So, <laughs> I love this thing. No, I love the, yeah, I love this driver. Everybody tells me, everybody that watches my thing says, hey, why are you torturing yourself using this? I, I love it. So if I was to put it in my four dummies version, I would say keep everything basically the same. Just try to add some more of this and up. Yeah, so now watch this. You got to remember that when you're doing it, I like this, but as soon as we get really narrow, the right arm goes internal. You're getting very, very narrow here, uh -huh. which equals what? Yeah. Vertical shaft. So uh -huh. the more and more I had width, what yeah. would happen? Mm -hmm. My arm naturally, yeah, see that right there? So yeah. people go, I want to drop it in the slot, and all they're doing is compounding that. Keep your natural width, so if it's 90 here, keep your natural width to here, just go ahead and use your legs. Mm -hmm. There you go. So then keep your, it's not like you're pushing weight around, that's just normal. Okay, so don't be trying to like pull down well, what's, what What I'm used to is doing this, so when you say keep your, this feels natural to do Yeah, exactly. Because, but I actually have to kind of feel something. You don't have to, you just take two great drives, yeah. so I, I don't have to, yeah. you don't have to do anything. But what I'm saying is if you want, go to the top, and I would have to look at you from the other side, but I just keep your natural width here, okay? Mm -hmm. Right there, yeah. one more frame of turn. Yeah. Now you gotta turn right there, and now yeah. you can fire the right shoulder, right hip, okay. as the head goes back. Start watching the players and watch how much they're backing out. They're not backing out with a slide. Okay. They're backing out with a kick up. They're backing, so they're not backing, they're not uh, backing out. This is not what this. I want, no, exactly. They're backing out with after this. they after they've turned okay so watch this after i've got my yeah. thing after they've turned around yeah. then they start to kick out so it's around and then kick out it's not this way that's not what i'm looking for because yeah. oh, that's okay, death yeah. okay yeah. gotcha so like yes exactly that's beautiful okay. looks very good good setup i like it Beautiful. How was that? Oh, that was the best one I hit. <laughs> okay, pure. All right. Love cool. it. Good job. All right, three out of four is pretty good. Good man. Yeah. I would take that on the golf course Paul all the time. <laughs> so George is posting to his Instagram right now. So de definitely, uh, definitely GG subscri Swing Tips. subscribe to GG Swing Tips on Instagram and on YouTube too. He's got some really interesting, very cool things on YouTube. And uh, then you. check out any information he has on there about his membership site. It's, if you guys are um, looking to get really a lot more deep into some, some detail has, yeah some detail thank you you can, yeah. you can, you can check that out for what sure. else george um before we wrap up here uh, thanks for listening um i hope it helped and uh you're a good dude am i going to be able to get you out on the course one of these days i would to love to i would love to i would love to okay you just cool. let That'd me know fun. when it would be totally cool great all right, all right guys thanks for watching subscribe to my channel Yes. Also, thank thank you to Fish Fit. He's, Fish he's Fit. here. Uh, if you go on youtubecom slash Fish Fit, come on in, Fish. <laughs> he has a golf fitness uh, uh, YouTube page and does some other fun things there. We're going to be vlogging as well. Uh, probably the three. Maybe maybe we can get the three of us and uh, all together for like a mini skins game on camera. That'd be all awesome. right, guys. See you later. Thank Thanks. you, guys. Bye.